Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I review and unbox subscription boxes here on my channel and today we have another subscription box mashup where I review three different boxes in case I miss any of the details or any of the referral codes or affiliate links. They will all be listed for you in the description box below. Hopefully if I get around to it with some timestamps, if you're able to though, please do watch the entire video. It definitely helps my channel out and I would truly, truly appreciate it. Let's go ahead and get started today day with my paper box which is a personalized stationary subscription they actually have three different subscriptions the grand which is what I have to share with you today the mini which is three personalized notepads within a theme as well as the greeting card subscription which is four greeting cards per month so you always have one on hand like I said this is the grand which often includes all kinds of desk accessories and paper goods including greeting cards notepads some other fun desk accessories sometimes we'll get some stickers and it does always Always, of course have whatever name you choose on there whether it's your family name the gift recipient name because it is a really fun gift option or your own name now she just sends it to me for review with your name here which I don't mind at all but it is fun to get things with your name on it of course which is why it makes it such a fun gift subscription so inside it just says happy to see you here and then we have our little mini magazine from my paper box for this is edition number 54 you guys so my paper box has been around for a while the mini subscription is $24 per month and this grand subscription that I'm sharing with you today is $38. I will leave a link for you, like I said, in the description box below. So inside we just have our full spread calendar, but throughout the magazine what she does is really fun. She tells us all about the different holidays and observances throughout the month, different ways that you can celebrate or acknowledge them. For example, March 6th was Oreo cookie day, which I missed out on you guys. There's all those other cookies that are swirling around my house right now um, but fun observances of course we have March 29th is National Mom and Pop Business Owners Day so maybe you can support a little mom and pop shop I think that's great March 21st is a national or world poetry day not just the nation but the entire world is appreciating poetry I was just looking to see what day this was gonna post so it's probably gonna be posting on the International Day of Happiness which is the 19th we love that so inside we always have a little letter from Sam just kind of telling us about our inspiration. So it says, sending good vibes this month with our crystal box. March marks the start of spring. March being National Craft Month, I designed the item so you can be creative and spruce up that birthday card you've been meaning to send. All right, so we have a lovely image of, of crystals there that almost look like layered jello to me. Beautiful colors though beautiful spring colors and she did just announce the theme for the next box which would be the one that you would be getting in on if you subscribe soon enough and that is going to be florals which we absolutely love let's actually have a secret password you guys now if you are new to my channel we've been doing this for over a year when you hear a secret password in one of my videos you want to enter it along with your contact information in the Google form that is linked for you in the description box below not the comments please it has to go into the Google form and then at the end of the month I go through with a random number picker and I select a few winners to receive a mystery box from yours truly as my way of saying thank you so much for watching my videos you have to be 18 years or older you have to be subscribed to my channel not necessarily publicly I can confirm that with you via email and remember that it is not affiliated with YouTube or any of the boxes that I open here on the channel so today's secret password is going to be floral because of spring which is almost here you guys all right let me go ahead and get into the contents of the box to share with you so lots of things. I don't always have a ton of time to share everything, but I will try my best. So we got some really cute gemstone kind of word art stickers this time around so that you can add a personal touch and stylize your own um, cards this time around. So I wanted to take the plastic off so you guys could see the sparkle. Do you see the little sparkle that makes it look like, you know, when someone smiles in the movies and it goes ding and you can see that shine on their teeth. So that's what that looked like. We got a fun sticker set. That's kind of different. And we have a whole bundle here that I'm opening up. So here are the greeting cards with gemstone designs that then you can add those fun stickers to. So here's one like this. Here's one like this that obviously has a spot for that nice word art, of course. We have some beautiful bright envelopes, so two in yellow and two in green 
for our four cards. Here's another gemstone with a border. You could go this way if you wanted to. And then finally, this one. So we got four lovely gemstone themed cards with lovely envelopes that then you can add to and stylize with your own stickers. You can be, get a little bit crafty. Now I also always get a nice desk calendar, which I usually put right into a little card holder on the other side. It does tell us about some of those holidays and observances that she kind of expands on in the magazine. We got two cute stickers that say time to recharge. Of course, a lot of people like to charge their crystals. So that's kind of a cute, fun thing. You could definitely put those onto the onto the cards as well if you wanted to. Here, it looks like we got a few postcards with some beautiful gemstone images. So here is some amethyst. It says, you're a gem of positivity. On the back, it's even got a little border and the postcard styling. So you can actually send it as a postcard. You are a great gem with some like pink quartz here. And there's our little accent on the back. I like that she did the two-sided printout on these. You are a gem of good energy with some nice dark, maybe citrine there. So that's always kind of fun. Those were really pretty and punny because she loves the puns over there. And then we did get three notepads, so, in different sizes. This one has those same, you know, this is kind of fun because we've got those geometric designs. Here they're filled in, and here this is just perfect for those of you who love to, you know, be on the phone, you're taking notes, or you're in a meeting, but you want to doodle and kind of color things in. This is a perfect notepad for that. This one is a lined notepad, if you're like me, and you like to be a little bit neater about things. And then this one just has some, like, watermark gemstones in the background so we did get those three different notepads as well as the three postcards our desk calendar our monthly magazine and then of course we got the four four greeting cards with the fun sticker set and I think that's really really cute so she's showing us how you can add those stickers and then create your own card so that was our grand subscription my paper box for the month of March and like I said it is going to be a floral theme for next month which is perfect for spring so definitely get in on that if you have not already let's move on though to our candle subscription which of course is a Vela box this is also sent to me for review before I forget I've got a great code for you. It is Noel 50 that will save you 50% half off of your first box. They have different uh, sizes. You can do the Lucerna, which is a four ounce candle each month for $18. You can do the Ignis, which is eight ounce candles for $28 a month, or the Vivere, which is what I have to share with you today, which is a 16 ounce candle, and that is $38 per month. One of the other really cool things is that they have free shipping in the U.S., but it is just $5 to Canada. It always comes in the is a nice little box and then we always have a Spotify playlist for the vibes of the box so this one is actually affirmations for creating good luck because a lot of us have luck on the brain right with that St. Patrick's Day holiday they always include a reusable nice little um, fabric pouch I love these for different things like look at bottles different things that I'm using when I'm packing my suitcase it's really nice to keep everything organized and then of course the candle vessels themselves are always uh, reusable as well and can get really creative with different ways to reuse those and I just love that they feature a different uh, candle company every month so you can really find ones that you enjoy now they always have various scents and when you first sign up you tell them what kinds of scents you like if you like fresh crisp if you like floral if you like more you know woodsy scents if you like a good classic pumpkin spice latte around the holidays you can make sure that you always get those holiday scents as well I usually like a really fresh light scents kind of oceany vibes sometimes I like a little hint of floral but you know in the winter months when it's dark and cold I also really love those deep amber musky scents as well and honestly Vela Box has never really steered me wrong so I trust them along with your candle whatever size you always get a free bonus gift which is awesome and it usually has a value of at least ten dollars which I think is amazing so for your candle subscription you know you're always re-upping I would go always go with the big one because I usually have a candle burning in my house because I work from home and it just kind of helps me start my day by lighting that candle and helps me end my day when I use my little snuffer to blow it out so you get your candle, whatever size works best for you and your lifestyle, and then you also get a little free gift and a Spotify playlist. I think that is fun. And then all these reusable, beautiful pouches. I think that one's really nice. It's kind of almost like a denim or a chambray. So this time around, we got, ooh, from Wax Crescent is the company, Bamboo and Bergamot with 
mandarin and amber so you guys it's got all the things in there it's got you know bamboo nice fresh scent it's got some what they say amber and mandarin i love me a citrusy scent so this is going to be really good all right Ooh, that is nice i feel like hmm I, I'm smelling definitely, it's got like everything, right? Bamboo, bergamot, we've got floral, we've got citrus. It's really nice though. It's a little bit more floral and fresh than I was expecting, but I absolutely love it. So let's hear about our featured maker. It says, for Wax Crescent founder Kim, lighting a candle is a ritual for me too, Kim. It says that first thing she does every morning to start her day in an intentional way. I swear I did not read this ahead of time, you guys. It says, it signifies that I'm creating a sacred space for myself and taking time to move into my day thoughtfully and with purpose. She began creating her own candles in 2017 with pure ingredients, a much cleaner version than the candles she had previously been burning. Wax Crescent was founded in 2019 in Colorado with the intention of creating luxury and intriguing candles that are eco-friendly and clean burning. The elevated fragrances are inspired by memories and connected to meaningful moments and experiences. Wax Crescent hopes that their candles encourage self-care for all. And then of course, most of these companies will include a code, a discount code, if you want to go on their shops uh, and find more of their lovely fragrances and candles so if you find out or you've seen an unboxing that there was another fragrance that you probably also would have enjoyed and that's not the one that you got from Vela Box, you can go on and get more let's see what our free gift is oh the description of the scent is a sunny and serene scent that will boost your mood and alleviate stress enjoy this delightful fragrance with a warm bath a good read or anytime you need a pickup pick me up I love that all right so our surprise item this time is super cute it's actually Vela Box branded it's a little corduroy pouch little zipper bag it's got a $12 value it says a multi-purpose essentials bag use it for cosmetic storage purse or tote organization travel and more we created this with a neutral corduroy fabric to complement other bags that you may carry it in I think it's really cute with a little like gold zip I think that's adorable and I, I love corduroy it's kind of vintagey vibes whenever anything is in corduroy right all right guys I will be burning that like the the Vela box candles always go right to the head of the line for me all right we have a one more box to take a look at I took a little break from rocks box for a while now rocks box is more of a jewelry rental subscription which is great because other jewelry subscriptions yeah you, you get to keep what you got but maybe if it's not quite your style you're not so excited about keeping what you got but rocks box like I said is a rental service so you can send everything back and all you paid was the $21 per month rental fee or you can apply that rental fee to purchasing one of the products and if you are a rocks box subscriber then you're already getting discounted prices now they have changed up the box once again since the last time I got it so this is kind of fun now I am actually a subscriber they do not send this to me for review but I do have a link and a code for you so the link will be down below but the code is Noel N B F F one like you're my BFF and that will get you your first set of three pieces that you can select for yourself with well there's a stylus but I'll tell you about it in a second and then you also get that $21 credit so you get the three pieces to use as long as you would like well in that case for a month and then you can send everything back if you want after you tried it on or you can use that $21 in credit to uh, to keep one of the pieces. Now there's usually a deal if you keep all three pieces, even if it's over the course of several months, then you can get $10 off. Sometimes it's 20, depending on if they're running a special or not. Um, I usually will keep like one of the pieces and then it's a really good way to try some big expensive designers where you don't necessarily need the piece. Maybe you have an event coming up where you're like, I just wanna like get to feel fancy and it's like a $200 piece. I think I got a couple of those in here. Um, and then you wear it and then you send it back and then they of course they clean everything up they also include uh, the mailer bag that everything comes in they include the shipping label so you just send it back whenever you're ready now in terms of the wish list you go through you fill out that wish list and then they actually send you a preview the night before they're ready to send your set and you can swap out pieces if you don't like what they chose for you you can be like no I actually want this piece and I want this piece and I want this piece and then that's what they will send to you or you can be surprised it's, it's fun that way too all right so let's take a look and then they also have it kind of printed out on this other uh, reverse side of your shipping label, what you got. Now I got two Kate Spade pieces because I love Kate Spade jewelry. It is whimsical, it is fun, it is beautiful. They have two really beautiful floral sets right now. So I got the earrings from one set, it has a matching statement collar necklace, and then I got the collar necklace from the other set that has matching statement earrings. So I probably should have just got the set, but I figured that way I wouldn't be as tempted to keep everything. And again, some of the pricier pieces. So 
we are going to start with, like I said, I have the two Kate Spade bags here in pink and the one Rocks Box bag. We'll start with the Rocks Box bag, which I actually got a ring, so obviously they do sizes. This is the Kennedy ring in gold. It is $46. That's the member price. And so, of course, I would be able to apply my $21 in credit. It fits on my middle finger. I went with a larger size because I already have a ton of rings on my ring size, finger size. It's just kind of fun. I thought that was kind of neat and like sculptural. I don't know if it's something that I would keep because, honestly, I don't wear a lot of rings besides my wedding ring just because I kind of forget sometimes and I'm often typing and like fiddling with things but I thought it was kind of a neat looking ring what do you guys think let me know in the comments below I always love to hear what your thoughts are what you think I should keep you know $46 but subtract the 21 so I could keep it for what 25 bucks it's not bad it feels pretty good on my hand it feels like it might be a little bit loose but it looks like one of those fun um, puzzles right I don't know, it's kind of growing on me. So I'll just keep that on my hand for now. Let's get into uh, Kate's fancy stuff now. So for, uh, you know, this set, you guys, uh, it would be, I'd have to spread this out over a few months and apply my $21 to one piece at a time for three months, but I would still get that $10 off. All right, so this is the necklace that I got. This is the rooftop garden beaded necklace. So like I said, there's a rooftop garden set. The other one is the floral frenzy set. I got the earrings from one and the necklace from one. So perfect for a lovely garden party. Now this, I think is my second favorite set. I love the other one, but this has like a very vintage uh, kind of vibe to it. Like if you found this in a vintage store, you'd be like, oh, I... <laughs> This came from someone's grandma's closet. Um, so it's got lots of sparkle, lots of spring color to it. Kind of those antique stylized flowers. You guys, the price on this though is, is not small. It is $198. Now it does have an extender chain, but I just, I'm not sure. I think I don't like the pearls because you know, they're not real pearls. Um, but I do love the colors cause it's almost that like muted antiqued gold. And then like this flower right here I absolutely love so maybe what I would like more this kind of reminds me of that Christmas necklace that I always wear that you guys love um, so I might see about maybe getting the earrings instead although I will say this necklace is pretty hefty so I'm guessing that the long dangle earrings would also be kind of hefty and that is something that I've noticed with a lot of Kate Spade uh, earrings you know it doesn't bother me that much but they can be a little bit heavy it is kind of a fun spring piece. Let me just uh, move my YSM compass around. So that is actually really pretty and it feels good. So what if I had a spring garden party to go to um, or if I had the right dress, maybe I would wear it. I do have a couple events coming up, so maybe I will take them with me. Uh, and I've had no problems like traveling with items, obviously. So maybe I will take this with me and try it on. But this is like an example of a statement piece that I'd probably only want to wear a couple of times and I don't need to necessarily keep it. Now the necklace that goes with the Floral Frenzy set the thing is, I love that necklace. The flowers are even bigger, but you wouldn't want to necessarily wear it with the earrings and the necklace. Same thing with this necklace that I just showed you. It seems like it would be a little bit too much to do the earrings and the necklace, so maybe I'll check out the earrings from that set. All right, here is the Floral Frenzy Drop Earrings, and yes, they do have some weight to them, but you can kind of see, you guys, this is the sort of um, where it's almost that sort of I forget what you call that, not cloisonne, but you can see it's like those sort of enamel or acrylic flowers, like great big ones. So we've got like a big old orchid, and then we do have a little crystal drop at the bottom. So the rooftop garden has a lot more of those crystals that catch the light. This is more of that sort of enamel look to it. These are $168, but the necklace, you guys, has even bigger flowers, and it's sort of like gradiated where it gets bigger um, towards the center but it might just be a little bit too much to wear the necklace and the earrings together. Now I wouldn't pair the two floral sets together either because they're kind of a different vibe, but I'm gonna go ahead and try these on. Again, taking off my YSM earrings, you guys, which, you know, I hope I get to review their box again one of these days because I do really like the pieces that she creates and those were from her birthday sale. I couldn't help myself. I had to get them. So let me go ahead. It's just a simple post. Now I will say sometimes the posts on Kate Spade earrings can feel a little short for me because I have, I guess I have fat earlobes. I don't know. So I'm just going to 
try these on to see how heavy they are and hopefully it's not too heavy and hopefully I'm not like bending anything here sometimes the post might be a little bit bendy so it's not too heavy I wouldn't want to wear it for a really really long time but aren't those fun if I was wearing like a nice white frock going to a garden party I think those are really really cool so yeah I would probably be relieved at the end of the day to take them off but I might have to try the necklace too, but it's one of those things where I like, I don't necessarily want to keep the earrings, but I want to see the necklace. I don't know, but I also might want to try on the other floral earrings. So you guys let me know in the comments below. I do have quite a bit of credit, so these could be a little bit of a splurge. Uh, and they're probably something I would wear more than a statement necklace, but I would love to hear what you guys thought about all of the boxes today, what your favorite items were, which jewelry pieces you should think I should keep, and if you missed it, there was a secret password, so make sure you go back and watch to find that. Thank you so much for being here today. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you all soon in my next unboxing. Thank you.